Hello, my sexy people. It's High Priestess Krill Queen. It's the witching hour, and I'm feeling witchy. Tonight, I want to talk to you about my, my get sexy spell. Okay? Um, but before I talk to you about my get sexy spell, I want to... Um, I'm going to read to you a story that I wrote. It's called Our Date to the Cemetery. Okay. So, um, as you know, I'm a writer. And one day I hope to write a dark, erotic novel. Um... So, you know, after I read the story, I want you to, you know, tell me what you think and um, comment in the comment section below. Okay? Our date at the cemetery. I think it was something about that daydream that I had about you earlier. You looked so sexy as you stood there, dressed in all black. I never wanted anyone as much as I want you. Whenever I think about you, I feel all warm and tingly inside. My skin gets so wet, it makes my fingers slide. I have a special surprise for you tonight, lover. I'm going to visit you tonight at midnight. We will go to the cemetery. And there we will find all sorts of trouble that we could get into. We'll commune with the dead and we'll collect skulls. I will make you fall in love with death. Within my gates, you will hear the sound of the winds caught up in the moaning of the trees. We'll view the signs and symbols of hidden decay. I am an open space covered in darkness with black roses, violets and daisies and red carnations. There's no sweeter place to be buried. There's something seriously wicked about the thought of you pinning me, pinning me up against a tomb and kissing me passionately. That just makes me go wild. We'll find a nice spot for a picnic. I want to touch you, feel you, caress you as we talk of graves and zombies and ghouls and worms that corrupt flesh. We'll give offerings to the spirits. I'll dry your tears. Oh, I'm sorry. We'll write our sorrows upon the bosom of the earth. And I'll dry your tears as we lay on the grass. I'm turned on at the thought of us completely naked and smearing the dust of the ground all over each other, making promises never to abandon one another. I will let you have your way with me right there on the scraggly grass. Now, you complete that story in the comment section, okay? And we'll see how creative you are. Okay, so um,
I need to um pull up the get sexy spell. For my get sexy spell, it's for you know if you feel that life has caused you to lose your sex appeal, okay? You know, sometimes family life. Um, having babies, working hard, and just being in the routine of things can put a damper on your sexy. Yes, it can. You don't have time to work out. You don't have time to focus on yourself, you know, the self-care that is necessary for you to feel sexy, you know. But being sexy is about having a certain... Je ne sais quoi, or a sexy state of mind. Okay? Loving yourself for who you are and being comfortable in your own skin is the sexiest thing in the world. So it's all about being yourself, being confident in yourself and your sexiness. You know, it will just, it will just shine through. Okay? So, um, Yeah, so like I was saying, being sexy is about having a certain je ne sais quoi, okay? Loving yourself, being yourself, being confident in yourself, and your sexiness will shine through, okay? So, um, So this ritual is designed to help rejuvenate and increase sexual power, sexual confidence, and magnetism. Okay, um, it will also attract a sexy state of mind. Okay, it'll make you feel sexy, it'll make you feel attractive. Um, This is a coercive spell that must be repeated at intervals. And this ritual works best when coupled by um, the person's will and intent. <clears throat> so you have to cooperate. Um, The intention must be spoken slowly, slowly and in a strong voice or a strong whisper, will, that'll do too. Um, <clears throat> and after this spell, you should see immediate results, okay? So you're going to need some things for this spell. You're going to need a red candle. Now 
Now I'm going to use, um, I have a couple that wants to get sexy together. So I'm going to use um, the red penis candle and um, the red vagina candle. And um, if you want to, you can also use a, a red figure, um, a female figure or a male figure. Because this spell could be for male or female. You know, it, it really doesn't matter. Okay. Gender neutral. Um, <clears throat> you're going to need some love oil, maybe your favorite perfume, you're going to need some sexual fluids for this spell. Because it's a type of sexual enhancement spell. You're going to need a full length mirror. You're going to need your sexy photos. You're going to need, um, some incense, like um, <clears throat> maybe some Kama Sutra, or um, I have um, Honey Love, or something like um, Rose, Rose and Honey, or something like that. You're going to need flowers or rose petals, or um, I have a I have a blend. I have a mixture of um, different flowers and um, rose petals. You're gonna need um, a platter. Some rose water. Um, Some love salt, and um, you can use catnip. Catnip is optional, okay. <clears throat> and also some music, you know, something that puts you in a sexy mood. And you're gonna um, you're gonna write some intentions. You're gonna write some affirmations. Now, your intentions will sound something like this. You could put whatever you want, but um, you're going to say, I am a beautiful, sexy goddess. I have unlimited sexual power and sensuality. I am sexually confident and full of sexual magnetism. 
my body is a beautiful gift of nature. My body is attractive and sexy. I love and accept my body completely. I love my eyes, my lips, my hips, my legs. I love my curves. I am fine. <laughs> I love my naked body. I'm in touch with my deepest sexual nature and desire. Sexual desire and seduction is burning deep inside of me. I have a sexy imagination. I'm filled with erotic energy. I let go of all of my fears and I enjoy being a sensual goddess or God. And that's what you're gonna, that's what you're gonna say to yourself as you look into the mirror. So now I'm going to show you how I do this spell. Okay. Got my vagina candle. And I have the red penis candle. Okay, so um, <clears throat> I've already carved the names and I'm just going to show you how to dress it, okay? So I'm not going to do too much talking, but I'm going to show you what I'm going to do. <clears throat> so I have some... Um, Come to me oil. I have some follow me oil. I have some attraction oil. I have some handsome friend oil. And honey love oil. Um, And I also have a special oil that I make myself. You know, you just use a base of olive oil. And I have some rose petals in there. And I have some glitter. And 
and I also have some other love oils that's mixed in. But yeah, you can make all of that yourself. <laughs> So I'm going to use all of these oils. <clears throat> Plus I'm going to use um, some magnetic oil. And I'm going to be working with my Inca Sex Guide. Mm -hmm. so that, you bless that. <laughs> yeah. And he always, always brings me luck. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> and also you're going to use three feathers. I have a red feather, a pink feather, and a black feather. Pink is for power and change. No, oh. Black is for power and change. Pink is for self-love. And red is for passion. Just gotta heat that oil up. And I know this look nasty, but y'all need to get your minds out the gutter. <laughs> As you putting all your blessings all your energy into that. And you're going to go in an upwards motion because you want to attract to you. Okay, and then um, I'm gonna put some um, some love salt. And this is going to make you sexy. <laughs> I 
I know I should get a lot of dislikes on this video. Mm -hmm. Especially the religious dick sucking hoes. <laughs> Welcome to hell. And so you're going to do the same thing with the vagina candle. Y'all yeah, know I'm nasty. <laughs> okay. And then you um sprinkle some of salt on this too. some rose petals or well, some mixed flowers and rose petals That's me, black magic woman. So you're gonna put that around your candles. I'll show you what I'm doing. Shit. 
Did you see that? Burn my fucking hair. I forget how long my fro is getting. Shit. <laughs> well, my video won't be complete without humor, would it? Okay. Shit, I can smell that shit too. Oh my god. Burn my damn hair. I gotta remember. Okay, get this shit far from me. So I'm going to sit this up like this, and I'm going to have the penis facing the vagina like that. And they're going to get sexy together. And so um, I'm going to put a black feather. I'm going to put a red feather. And I'm going to put the pink feather. And there you go. High Priestess Creole Queens. Get sexy spell. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. You know how to reach me if you would like a get sexy spell. It works. It's very powerful. Many of my clients have seen great results, immediate results. So please like and subscribe, um, comment in the section below, and add to the story of what I read earlier. Okay? Y'all have a good one. Peace.